You girls going to have some fun with some more girls? We are. We're going on another girls trip. I feel oh like gosh. Emmy has gotten lots of girl time. She's learning how to be a girl. But this time, we're going on a long road trip. This is Emmy's first road trip. That's longer than like 20 minutes, so we'll see how she does. I'm very interested to hear <laughs> the report. She's like, what? We're going on a road trip for like four hours. What the heck is going on, man? <laughs> Look at this Under the baby, eyes. I poop every two minutes. Dang it, yeah, mama. I was supposed to leave 40 minutes ago. <laughs> But it's okay, baby, we're getting there. We already had a blowout. We already had to change clothes. She ruined her first outfit. We're, we're getting, getting there. Getting off to a great start today. We're getting there. Okay, I, I am under the impression that this is going to be a difficult situation. I'm so worried about like time on the road. Well, the good so. thing is we're going to East Texas and there's not a whole lot going on in East Texas. So it's not like we're traveling on like major highways oh, or like something. Traffic jams and whatnot. Yeah. Wow, it's popping up in there. Huh? Yeah, homegirl? All right. You have lost most of your hair now, little honey, on your forehead. <laughs> it's like she's bald in the front, but she's got plenty in the back. All right, well, y'all get going. Um, please be careful. I will. And uh, Dad is going golfing. What a typical scenario, right? Actually, I don't golf, really. I love to, but usually I don't have time. The only reason I'm golfing is because I'm going to go fishing. Honey, you're looking good. Thank you're looking you. good for having a baby. Thank you. I appreciate that. Back in your old jeans. Yes, I can finally fit into my jeans. Yep. I almost need a belt too. Yeah. You should you should be like on uh, on like a calendar for um For flying, pregnant women. For post pregnancy <laughs> models. She's like, okay, let's get this party on the road. Let's start All this right. party. There you go. Locked. Locked and ready to roll. Okay. All right, honey, I will see you, I guess, later tonight. It's going to be late night. Love yeah, you. Have love a good time. Yes. When we first dated, I went and saw the girl. I'm going to take you along the ride, show you the grand. <sighs> Meanwhile, while that's not going on, I'm going to show you everything that happens in Kilgore, East Texas. So, actually, we're going to pass by Emory, Texas, too. E.T. E.T. Two things about E.T. Kilgore Rangerettes, skater boats. That's about all you need to know. All right, y'all go have a good time. All Thanks right. Again. Love you. So we had to stop and get some gas before we headed out on the road because there's not a whole lot to stop at in East Texas. So if you run out of gas or you need to run to the bathroom, there's uh, you're kind of out of luck. So I don't think I fully explained kind of where we're going to y'all. We are going over to East Texas, which if you don't know where East Texas is, obviously it is the east part of Texas, but East Texas is known for a little town called Kilgore, Texas, and that's where I spent the first two years of my college experience, and I was on the dance team, and their dance team is called the Kilgore College Rangerettes. It was the first ever established drill team in America. So the cool thing is I get to go back at least once a year, um, especially on like the big celebrations, and this weekend happens to be homecoming for the girls. This is Emmy's first time ever going back to Kilgore College. made it to Kilgore and if you guys have not been to Kilgore yet this is basically it it's your accent comes out if you're wondering that's what happens when you drive in here <laughs> it really does <laughs> there's the other girls dorm I feel like that was kind of redone too what's a little bit looks like it okay and then this is the residence hall for the Rangers oh oil Derek back in the day Kilgore was known for the oil so there's a lot of old money here, here in Kilgore the richest acre. But basically, so Kilgore was founded off the oil industry. There's the dorm. Wait, Rizzle. they made this a two-way. Things have changed. This is it, guys. This is campus. Can we, is there anywhere to park? Don't worry, Emmy's still snuggled. Emmy! Ta-da!
All right, so Emmy has officially made it almost to the game. She's making her debut. And if you guys can see, the parking lot is completely full. So for Kilgore, I feel like the entire town has showed up for this game. Just check this out, guys. Look at all the cars. So <laughs> I feel like if you're not from East Texas, like this could just look like a high school football game, but it's not. Oh no. Got rows of cars. Well, it's Tyler Junior College. So every year homecoming, we play the exact same team. I say we. Kilgore we, we, plays the exact same team, and it's um, Tyler Junior College. It's pretty much like the drill teams are two rivals, the schools are two rivals. Do we have a better band than them? I don't know. Tell them all about your adventure. Mine. Did you go see the girls? Did you go see all those girls? Yeah, Daddy had to go do that too. She was a little bored. Oh, like. she really liked the band music. I think she had fun. Well, what did y'all think about that whole situation? Because I've been there, and there's only two things really going on there. There's Skeeter Boats and Kilgore Rangerettes. I think I've said that before. And uh, it's pretty cool that I married one. Old Texas tradition. Well, did you was... tell them it's the first organized dance team? I sure did. I said it was the first drill team established in first America. First official drill team. That's right. I'm glad Amy got to see where the Rangerettes are. Maybe for one day she'll she'll be kicking with them. I think she wants to be a Rangerette. You Maybe so. Ranger? I'm sure all those girls were like cooing and like, oh, oh, I can't wait for her to be a Rangerette. Oh my gosh. You know they I can were. see it. I can see it right now. Maybe for her next Halloween, she'll be a ranger. Speaking of Halloween, it's coming up. And if you guys missed our pumpkin carving episode, it'll be linked down below. Uh, I didn't win, just spoiler alert. <laughs> I think you came in third. I came in, I came in third. Dads always lose, you know. We, uh, we are the providers, we work hard, we're not the coolest out of the group a lot of times. All right, well, I think it's time to send this off. Now that we are home again, safe and sound. Well, we hope wherever you are, you're having a very blessed day, y'all. And don't forget to subscribe right here. Until then, we'll see you right back here.